Welcome to my diary. My name is Janelle. Today's movie is not the usual comedy you find at the cinemas. It's an inspirational true life story of a lady who couldn't keep her pregnancies to term. She kept losing them. Fortunately for her, she had a supportive husband, but a monster in law who was not in support of their marriage. She even advised her son to go out and get another lady that would give him a child. She was ridiculed, she was disgraced by the society to the extent that she even contemplated suicide. But her PA came to the rescue and bore her a child through IVF, of course. But when her PA lost all that was dear to her, an unpleasant, bitter drama ensued between both of them. And then questions arose over the origin of the child. And then they were also dragging for the custody of the child. Now, there were many twists and turns that you would never ever see in this movie. In essence, this movie delves into the lives of women, of families, of what they go through in search of children, especially surrogacy and its complications. It's a movie that is deep and you would learn something from. There was a scene that just didn't make sense to me. The lady's husband, um, Mene's husband, he went to bed with a towel on his neck. Really? Who does that? I just didn't understand that. But aside from that, the movie was fantastic. The storyline, which I said was a real life story, it's unique. When Mene was crying in anguish over the loss of her baby, it was so real. I could feel her pain. The acting was so original. And then the name tussle between the mothers, the Igbo mother and the Yoruba mother was something hilarious. I couldn't help but laugh. And then this last scene is a scene that I love the most and I'll drop it and I'll be gone. 20 million Jesu! Don't forget to like our page and follow us on all our social media handles. Thank you very much. Have a lovely weekend.